In this pegmonic, endometriosis characteristics are represented by the endometrium roses at the inner layer of the uterus with characteristics. In this disorder, there is ectopic endometrial tissue outside of the uterus, the endometrial tissue box outside of the uterus. And this tissue is composed of glands and stroma, the gland with straw man. This ectopic tissue most commonly is found in the ovary, pelvis, peritoneum, and bowels. The number one foam finger at the ovary, pelvis, parrot toe, and bowels bowl. Endometriosis presents as a chocolate cyst in the ovary, the chocolate sisters in the ovary, and can coexist with adenomyosis, the adenome mayo, where there is tissue in the myometrium. Theories for how this disorder initiates includes retrograde flow, the retrograde flow, metaplastic transformation, the metal plastic material transforming, and mullerianosis, the mule nose. So in quick summary, endometriosis is when there is endometrial tissue outside of the uterus, and this ectopic tissue is composed of glands and stroma. It's most often seen in the ovaries, pelvis, peritoneum, and bowels, and in the ovary, it's described as a chocolate cyst. When in the myometrium, it's called adenomyosis. Theories for pathogenesis include retrograde flow, metaplastic transformation, and mullerianosis. For endometriosis, imagine a Valentine's Day parade with a uterus float, and there are these endometrium roses tossing tissues from the inner layer of the uterus out into the crowd. The float has a little scene of romance playing out on board, with chocolate sisters in the ovary swooning over the muscular adenome mayo coming from the myometrium as he's giving them chocolates. There's a straw man with his glandular valentine dates, but they're also secreting stuff all the time, so he's pretty stoked to get some tissues. As the number one fan of this parade, the parrot toe sets up early every year to claim a spot for his pelvis chair on ovaries. But he gets so excited this year that he kicks over his bowel bowl lunch. The splashing mess makes the mule nose pulling the float want a tissue box as well. He leans over to receive a box from the metal and plastic transformer. Instead of littering the streets, people need only leave their metal and plastic in the bin, and they transform into tissues. The retro guy was getting the crowd pumped with his dance moves, until fluid flowed in a retrograde fashion through the float and soaked him. Needless to say, he was quick to request some endometrium tissues of his own.